Hey everyone, Jetfine here. Welcome back to Hardcore Tarkov, episode 58 here. As promised, we're hopping back on the shoreline. We need to make money and get a few key parts, but really just the money and uh, good stuff. We'll see you in the raid. Alrighty, here we go. Not the most ideal spawn here, but I am going to go. We're going to go back, loot some caches here, and then head in. And it's only going to get darker. Or, actually, it's going to get brighter because of the moon moonlight. But, uh, no, we'll, we'll skip those two and we'll head to these two. Because there's some loot over in this corner as well. Full auto 1x. There's a player. Maybe doing the same thing. Recommendations of uh, websites that new players use uh, to make navigating the maps easier and stuff like that. I mean, not necessarily. I mean, the wiki's good, but the, like the ma are the maps on the wikis are okay. It really depends on how well you read a map and how well maps work for you. You know, I just saw him at the last second. I just saw him at the last second. GG. That's on me for making noise and looking at chat. Um, uh, a nice shot to that guy. Yeah. What are they using? Yeah, that's PSC. I think it was a pistol. They'll be happy. Um, Map Genie. Map Genie has pretty good maps, but they don't have all the maps. And Overlord Actual. Yeah, it's been a second. Hope all's good. Um... It's alright. We made a million rubles with that with that kit and got key items, so I'm not I'm not happy I'm not unhappy about that at all. Like it's fine, you know. Okay, I loaded up the hideout real quick prior because I forgot we have to get this going. Yeah, and another alkali would give us another five bleach, which would be great. So that'll be a good one to get going as well for sure. And then once we have that, we'll put the NVGs on, and we'll I think we'll go nighttime. Um, I, although I think nighttime plus this is like kind of relatively the same, so. Alright, I do want to change up the map just to give it a bit of different a different feel. Um, so what we could do, if we're going for like quick runs here, like rubles per minute type of thing, we could hop onto reserve. Like slap one of these on. Call it good, you know what I mean? I guess we could also just like take these off, put that on. call that done you know what i mean um i don't hate that idea and then just like kind of kind of go get in there get, get in there get out real quick on money runs uh i guess the question then is what gun i could we could take this mpx i don't hate that idea i don't know why i have this we don't need it i'm pretty sure we don't need it I don't think we need that. Uh, that's definitely good. This is definitely good. That's okay to do that. I guess we have an AK-74N as well. We have this. We have this guy. Like we have a bunch of good ammo for these guys. Hmm. I'm just I'm kind of in the mood for this MPX. Does that not fit? That doesn't fit. Oh, but the MPX requires a lot of mags. So it's something that doesn't require a lot of mags to use. Because we, we want to be able to, like, soak up loot and get out, right? So either high capacity or, like, just two mags or, like, a shotgun.
And I'm gonna get to I'm gonna get to the map discussion in a second. For sure. Uh hmm. Could use it like a pistol, but I really don't want to I think that's like kind of wasting its opportunity. Well, we're hideouts loaded, so let's let's go hop in our hideout here. Let's maybe we'll grab the 74N and just like put a 60 rounder in it, call it a day. Not that 74N, this 74N. Could also bring in a pistol. That's actually another good way to do it. Oh, we have that Glock. You know what? Let's bring in that. Let's bring in a pistol. We have this Glock somewhere. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do this. Hit this with some modding. And then we literally just bring in this with the 50 rounds in it and put a flashlight on it and call it a day. That's it. No reloads. Um, super budget. I guess we could do reloads it's like one space okay that's not the worst not the worst all right yeah that'll be it um and then we go for i gotta switch my keys and then i need meds so i'll do the meds first real quick and then a heavy bleed of some sort maybe i'll just put these here now you know what the 50 rounds should be enough let's just let's just go with this we're gonna try to get us like if we get a scab kill good if we can't do it in 50 bullets can we even really do it at all I, you know i don't know okay <clears throat> and it has a two by two slot and one by three slots not that that's super relevant so that's good i'm gonna swap the keys real quick i'm gonna swap my keys real quick and then we'll uh see you on reserve all right here we go here we go is this the annoying spawn? This is the annoying spawn. It's my least favorite spawn. Oh, beepy. Nice. We're going to try to let everybody get in first. We do have the orb keys, which is really nice. I just... Um... We have the orb keys, which is really nice. I just, uh, everybody's go, everybody, and their mother's going there first. Actually, isn't it? I have to mark something over here, don't I, for, for Peacekeeper? Pretty sure. I think we had that task. We don't have RBST yet. say it's this one right over here well that's the direction i don't want to go so i'm going to go this way this might be one i need to mark as well i don't know some of them you just need to spot some of them you need to mark god damn it just like everybody's waiting go in and do d2 <laughs> i was waiting for the i was looking to see if i could plan here <sighs> gg it's fine. It's fine. I actually hit him too. Damn. Yeah, if I've been paying any half, if I've been paying attention at all, <clears throat> pistol jam. I did not have fixed it. Yeah, that's a that's a bit of a weird one. Make sure you're repairing your stuff before using it. So right click and then repair. Red Raven. Like if you take a scab gun in, make sure you're repairing it. Um, and then. It's like shift L, shift T, shift L checks the jam and then shift T fixes it or something like that. Or it's alt T. It's one of those combinations of things. You can look in your controls. It's like check malfunction and then fix malfunction. Some people like to put it on. There's, there's tricks you can do with the keys. I don't do that. I just do whatever's default there. All right. That was a bit of a bummer. That was a bit of a bummer. I'm gonna use this 
These are these are these kind of block you, so I'm gonna take these off. And then, oh, man, the I just I hate swapping key. This is my least favorite part. I hate having to swap keys, but I think we should go back to shoreline. <laughs> I just hate swapping keys. Because our goal is our goal is money and loot, you know. All right, I'm gonna equip this so I can. Let's see what we can trade for here. Oh right, we have level two. Right, or level three ragman now. Let's see what our barters are. Rooster for that guy. Those are still there. Still just that. Um, uh, this is really good. So small diaries were. I don't think the big diaries are actually available anymore for the Karun barter. I don't think those exist anymore, which is really kind of unfortunate. Um, you know, that's like super unfortunate. I mean, what are you going to do, right? But like, I was looking forward to having that barter. But it looks like these small diaries, which are easier to bring out of raid, trade for these. And this is pretty reasonable. So we can... We don't have side plates in it, but like it's got full plates. It's got left side, right side, soft armor. Like it's and it's got a bunch of points. So like it is much better than it used to be. So this one's the same and the staple. This one I think is not the greatest. Oh, it's roughly the same. Doesn't protect a lot of the area though, but it's fine. What is this bag? Thirty slaughter. A lot of dog tags, though. All right. oh, that's always sold out for some reason. Oh, we have access to this now, so these guys equal one of these MPPVs, which is pretty cool. Belt rig's pretty cool. I, I like that the roosters are now useful. That is nice. That is nice. So three keck tape equals a Glock. If you want to look at it that way, that's kind of a cool way to do it because you could trade three, three to the Three to Ragman, and then um, three for the clock, which is cool. I don't want to use the rooster because I need that for later. These suck now, right? Yeah, these are all these are all soft armor only, so don't want to be doing that. I don't want to be wasting a VHS player. Do not have that one still. So we filter by item here. I thought they were I thought they were doing player limits this go around and not global. Maybe maybe only for certain things. Don't know. Could do this barter again for an armor. We could go into zero to hero. We could just do like a pistol backpack. Try to make our runs a little bit quicker. Like I'm just, oh man. We're close but so far on this as well. So close yet so far. We do have that. That's why we're saving those. Bit of a stun lock here, I would say. Or a decision lock here. Oh, this gets us our not the right that gives us the this gets us the right thing as well, which is pretty cool. Yeah. But uh, so does this, but we need to save the roller, so that actually might be a better barter. Huh. I do not know. Good that we know, know that we have one of those. I am a little. Oh, we have this guy. Yeah, let's do let's do that as a pistol. Let's do that as a pistol. Do I have this thing? I do have one of these guys as well, so we can go in with a high capacity version of a of an AK and just use just use that, so we have more room for loot. But could go try to survive his factory a bunch. They rolled that back because it was bugged with no limits at all. Ah, gotcha. Okay, so hopefully we get that in the future. Hopefully we get that in the future. All right. 
could bring in this mechanism bag. Like, we're, we're allowed to do that. Like, we could just go all out back into, um, back into Shoreline. It sucks swapping the keys, but, like, what are you going to do? I need to save those. Okay, I don't hate that idea. And then... I would like... Oh, you know what armor we have? Save this one. Should be no longer bugged. Gives us all the stuff we need here. Can I put these in there? I totally can. Is that worthwhile doing? I don't know. <laughs> I don't need them in this thing, though. So, like, I can make this a level 6 armor, which I find extremely amusing. I don't know if that's worthwhile. For right now, you know what I mean? Alright, and also that's the case I might be bringing to this MPX here. Okay. You've been doing the sleeper armor too? Yeah, no, it's... it's I like the idea of that. Armor system is very confusing at the moment. I agree. I agree. I do genuinely like the idea of that, so... Gonna need to plant those soon. Can't wear those. Gonna need those. This is gunsmith. This is gunsmith. Uh, we need to plant one of these as well, but I just don't know if we're gonna get out with one. Okay, we'll put that there. We'll put these here. I think three mags at all times should be enough, right? What we'll do is we'll do... We'll do that, this, that. This will be our scav weapon. And um, these will be reloaded into players. I mean, these are backups in case we die, right? Which is what I like. All right, and then and then some meds here, and this is this is good for looting. I think we'll just use that, and then these will be fine. All right, I will once again be swapping my keys, and then we'll be hopping back onto shoreline. All righty. No MVGs, but. The snow does make it, like, a lot better. No sanitar either. Anything they sell well. Anything. That table's been empty the past few times. I want my oscopes back. I'm good on those, though. I actually need that for crafting purposes. Yeah, 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 for sure. I mean, the yeah, armors are probably still bugged and broken. That we're gonna work through all of that. But I think the idea that most people miss and are like, "I had a level five armor on. What the hell?" They thorax me. Is your plate doesn't cover your entire thorax? It covers most of your thorax, and the rest of it's soft armor that is not level five. I think that's the biggest misconception about the armor these days. Is they're used to the old system, where if your thorax is covered by level 5, all of your thorax is covered by level 5. So. And then, like, plates, when they stop a bullet, they don't do any damage. They do zero damage, and the plate doesn't even take that much damage. When the soft armor stops 
they take a bit more damage and you take blunt damage. I think those are the two main misconceptions there. So that's an SVT killing a scav in this compound. The question is, do I want to go fight for this compound or do I want to go loot elsewhere? And maybe try to get some of our tasks done. I didn't bring money for extract. All right, that makes that puts a nail in the coffin of me wanting to loot in that compound. I, I do want to loot there, but I really don't want to fight an SVT guy. And there's plenty to be had up here. I might have just missed a gunshot there by talking, but whatever. So reading chat and missing stuff by talking to chat are like missing sounds by talking are part of the game for me, right? I get to play five times more than a normal than the average user, but I also am going to miss things because I'm reading chat or I missed a sound because I was talking, you know? That's just the nature of the beast. Not for this account, Grim Ripper. Unless they were doing the exact same thing I was doing. Um, but I, we're we're kind of testing the testing the waters. I'm gonna be doing a duo play duo hardcore with similar rule sets to this with um, largely unemployed later this month. And that'll all be live streamed as well. So I'm looking really looking forward to that. I gotta start thinking about how I want to do thumbnails for that. So loose answer no, because I want this to be a solo thing this particular run to be a solo thing. But also caveat of maybe on the other account. After I'm done playing with large employee, yeah, our, our loose goal is level 20 on that one. It's not going to be a, like an in-depth playthrough. Instead of a scav army in Discord, you guys can you guys can do that. There's there's Tarkov designated areas, for sure. This feels like it's been looted. Okay, maybe not. So if you guys want to get together and play, please. If if I full time Tarkov, if I sorry not hardcore, if I full time Tarkov. Like, we did nothing but Tarkov for the next six months. I would probably try to organize stuff like that. Because I can only play hardcore for so much. But because I do other things, I got to spend my time wisely, right? So those kind of extra, like, fun days kind of, they don't go out the window, but, like, they're just, they're less likely to happen.
Have you seen bosses wipe uh, ha has been... Have you seen bosses as the wipe has been moving forward? Um, we've seen Sturman twice. And I think that's it. But yeah, they should be spawning more frequently soon. Or I think they already are above 10% now. Compared to the 5% they were at the start. At least it's not what I wanted. Oh, God. That used to th automatically throw the grenade. The goons got me on customs as well. True, true, true. Yep. I didn't ever put something in our hideout. I don't remember what. Yeah, so goons and, and Sturman, which we've actually killed Sturman twice. We just don't talk about what happened in the first time we did it. You know, we don't talk about that raid. Do a dead dogs. No, it wasn't Sturman. It was it was Dead Pine's fault. He says don't talk about it, and then he starts immediately talking about it. <laughs> now nah, that was the raid we went the wrong way and like missed out on a ton of loot. It's really good. I don't think we have room for it though i think this sells really well if i remember correctly we could we could potentially fit it in here by doing like that we'll see though oh you know we haven't planted the the marker up here yet we can do that one hey -o. behold a me what up zao chen Freddy with a 15 stream watch streak. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. More car batteries. It's a birthday, boy. Happy birthday. Heck yeah. So that's at pier, so maybe we're... I was originally going to go pier, but I guess not anymore. Turn 29 three and a half hours ago. Heck yeah. Very cool, very cool. Got any cool birthday plans or just sort of chilling? This may be a raid we should go into resort on as well. Like, our stuff's not the best. Could wait, though. You know what I mean? Like, give it till, like, 25. Oh, that guy already took that extract out. Interesting. I bet you that SVT guy didn't actually loot all of that area, by the way. I bet you, I bet you they missed stuff. I could almost guarantee it. I'm not going to go there, but I could almost guarantee it. See, that's up at resort. Your birthday's in 15 days? Nice. Happy birthday, Zao Chen. Ah, Just dang like it. you missed this grenade. I did miss that grenade. 
I also forgot to put this on the appropriate appropriate uh, thing. Thanks for the follows today, everybody. Appreciate that a whole heck of a lot. Explains why I missed a bunch of subs this morning. Thank you all. All right, that cash is up. Let's go for it. Salary sells very well. It trades for good bags later, or used to trade for good bags. I don't know if it does anymore. All right, so I think for resort, I'm going to try this. We're going to go... That's like bus depot area. I think I'm going to try going... Up the side, the new side. Oh, that was like one of my right footfall steps. Got it. Um, and into the east wing in that new area. Or the new way to get up there. And give it a go from there. Maybe go into admin building. You know, loot those safes. Look for our gold items. We do need gold items for the scab case. We are we are currently working towards that because Intelligence Center is installing right now. That was our last gate. There's filing cabinets there. And then we can kind of get a feel for if there's somebody in resort or not. And then we can try to get the generator rooms done. Full auto check here. Make sure on the player mag. Yeah, we get the, the generators room generators room done and the uh, nostalgia room for an extra docs case, which would actually save us some room because we can put keys in there. So. I think it's finally time. here. All right, Chad, I'm going to be focus mode, or not focus mode. I'm going to try not to talk as much so I can hear stuff. That's are good. All right, what do we not need? Genuinely. It's enough screws for what we need. These are all worth enough money to, that are like it's warranted keeping. I definitely don't need the Cobra. I do want these maps. 
Please barter well. And or sell well. Just gonna drink all of that. Funny, I'm gonna be using the I think light laser a lot less now. And just the light because um ADSing is king at the moment and the laser messes with me when doing that, so there we are. Horses are good, too. Um, but I think we have enough of those right now. I think we have enough of those now. Oh. Do not mind if I do. Those are pretty good, too. I hate to admit it, but they are pretty good. The other thing I can do is we could ditch an armor. Actually, can these? No. I could I could ditch an armor here for extra space as well. I think I would ditch this one. Although I don't know if this this front plate should fit in there. I think. So that wasn't at me. So there is somebody else here. I do technically need those, I guess. Scav, maybe? Well, Gamer Name Lewis, even if you sat down and watched literally every single every single YouTube video, you still wouldn't be caught up. We're on episode 58. I think 18 just released. <laughs> We're like 40 episodes ahead. I am going to have to slow down at some point. I just... Yeah. All right, let me discard that. Let me try something here. Not what I wanted. Uh, can I put that in there? I can. So does that mean I can put the, the better backplate in there as well? Absolutely cannot. Okay, so we got to figure that out. Oh, no, I need this one. Nope. I need the... Yes. A little bit of a wonky system, but it works. Okay, so we have a better front plate now. I'm addicted, gamer named Lewis. I'm genuinely addicted to this wipe. I can't I can't stop playing. I am having too much damn fun. I'm not even kidding. Like it's nuts. Maybe he did see me from outside. I don't know. Be be getting weird in here.
Maybe that was a player's cav. Kind of feels like it. I hear you on that. Uh, this is the longest I've ever played Tarkov in a while. They definitely made it better uh, in a sense. A hundred percent, yeah. I mean, there's a reason so many people are really enjoying this wipe so much. Yeah. All right, so if we put that into there. Let me put the things that I'm guaranteed always going to keep into here. GP coin. These sell really well. Screws we need. I forget what I needed that for. But we need it for something. Put that in there. I think I'm always guaranteed keeping that. Well, yeah, this wipe has been exceptionally amazing. I'll see this video in a month and some days. Hello, future me. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh, it's not compatible. I forgot about that. Okay, well, that sucks. Would net us an extra extra row there for some weight. That's fine. Let's... Like, these CPUs I, I could see getting rid of. Uh, this S mark can go for that. Let's get, let's get PSI going in here. Let's tag this as uh, the good stuff. Right? Yeah. I think pressure gauges sell well enough. Bit of a messy area, but I think it gets the job done. What's been the most difficult map so far? Interchange was definitely rough. Ground Zero was definitely rough. Um, trying to think what else. I mean, customs just for setup has been a little bit rough, but like, I don't know. I'm kind of going in super under geared for that. Oh, Breach is killer. If I could just buy stuff and get back in there and get into a good rhythm, customs would be pretty good. But I can't. I have to like every time I, every time I go in there and die, I just I don't have stuff to go back in again because hardcore. Okay, uh, let's grab that wire and get rid of that cord. Because that gives us access to what we need. Oh, sodium, let's go. Still need alkali for, for that now, but we want as much of that as possible. I think I should have a birthday emote. Maybe. So gray. <laughs> I only have 17 minutes here. We got to get a boogie on. Oh, not what I wanted. 
Leads sell well. This sells well. CPUs might be the next to go. Oh, I see nighttime. This this compared to what old to old school nighttime used to look like, Lewis. Ridiculously easy. Like this is clean and clear. But I'm also I'm also 1440p gaming and super high refresh rate and all the little extra. perks you can get, I guess. Sorry, dude. Oh, I actually need that for a gunsmith. So it looks like they looted a lot of everywhere else. That's pretty good stuff too. Get rid of that. Eat you. Um, I could. Switch to this to fit the fuel, but I think we're good on that. I need to be able to get out of here. All right. Uh, I didn't finish the safe in here. Let's finish the safe in here, right? Oh, no, I did finish the safe in here. I was just looking at the there. We don't need to worry about that. Let's, um, let's go get our generators. This is where all the scavs are going to be. Because scavs have their extracts here. leveling. Good morning, Doug Kevy. It's weird. For a second, my brain was like, oh, cool, you have MVGs on. I do not. In fact, have MVGs on. All right. Let's go get nostalgia. God, I can see all the way to the end of that hallway. That's nuts. Sorry, this isn't nostalgia, but I want to see if somebody opened this for me. They did not. Okay. Pretty sure that's where our skier thing is. And then what keys do I have here? 222. I don't think that's anything important. Um... 112. Uh. 112 is, though. Well, let's go to nostalgia real quick first. And, of course, we'll check 311. Nothing. Gold spawn there. Usually people check this. One was looted. Okay, here's nostalgia. And we'll get West 112. Oh, what's the uh, generator room? Shoot. Is that 222? Maybe that is 222. It's two something.
We're 43. We should be getting our stamina back here. I think this is the one that's always open? No. But 222 might go into it. No. Okay, so I do not have this one. Is it that one? Okay, so 219 as well. like hearing those sounds. Might be just time to leave then. Because the V-Swing's always open. Oh no, this does get there. Does it? No. Five, five. Some right key card spawn. There's some nudes. Good key, but not the greatest key. All right, so I still need a lot of keys for this then. It's 222 or 219. Yeah, we don't have either. All right. And we always have West 112, so I'm not going to worry about that either. So I think we are just going to leave. This AKMN is one of our gunsmiths. They're not the hardest thing in the world to find, but they're not the easiest. And we did a good job of checking the doors we don't have keys for. That is so flipping clear, dude. I mean, that means I'm super obvious as well. Like, it's not always the best thing. Sometimes you want cover of darkness, but, like, still... this time we can get our stamina back while walking so this is like morning time night time Flappy hat. No, it's it's like gray morning time weather. It's not. A, I think it's actually more daytime than it is nighttime here. But they did not. But they did have one of these, and they did have a shotgun. But that's besides the point. Uh, I think Helix is probably our least. Valuable. Not sure what I'd be ditching for a Yushanka, but we will have to ditch something for it. Rivals armband is 173k on, on flea and 12.4 to dealers. Ah, uh, 12.4 is still good for me though. I'm looking for 10k a slot. That's how I. That's how I kind of do my math. 10k to dealers per slot is, I think, more than valuable enough. Hey, enjoy your Terraria, Fennec. No worries. Time to get me a Hellforge. Let's go. I don't know what that means, but it sounds badass. <laughs> I wish you the best of luck. Oh, 
Oh, you know what else we could have done? We could have done a woods nighttime raid with this to try and farm, not farm, but like kill Sturman. This is, the MPX is actually a really good Sturman killing weapon. Um, you just want fast fire rate. And suppressed. And but we could also like loot his stash. Because if we get a red rebel from the stash, we can um sell all of our dry fuel for quite a large amount of money. Probably like three or four hundred K there. money. This is Shoreline. No, Sanitar's the boss on Shoreline. Um, Sturman is the boss on Woods, yeah. Terraria's one of those games you wish you could play for the first time again. I wish it wasn't 2D. I know that's part of the charm of it, but 2D just doesn't do it for me. In that particular... I like top-down, not side scroller 2D. But I probably should give it a shot at some point. Boost your stats a lot? Hell yeah. All right. Well, we had a, an extra six minutes to loot there, but that's okay. I think securing the gunsmith gun is uh, worthwhile. Uh, GG, GG. Oh, and our, pot, and our ox bleach just finished as well. That's actually really good. That's really good. So, big raid. We can we can now go work back go back to working on losing our kits with our six B forty seven pack of armor stuff. Um, we got a gunsmith gun for later. Hopefully, we have enough room to store it. We got money out. We got our file set, which we did. We're missing. Um, so yeah, good stuff. All right. <sighs> still, still missing so much space here. Okay. Uh, let's see if any of these will stack up in here. I guess. Not in a great way. All right, but that's enough to put that shrimp away. This is where the fun begins. All right, we're saving those. We're saving that. We're saving that. Let's try to make a little cell pile down here. I think I'm going to sell this, too. Um, that stacks a little bit, I guess. Yeah, one, one green gunpowder would go a long way. So here's a question for, like, are we saving for this? This is actually really good, this wipe. It's 25 piles of meds and 10 ophthalmoscopes. 10 ophthalmoscopes is not unreasonable, and piles of meds you can craft. I, th I think I'm going to sacrifice the 50k rubles. I think I'm legitimately going to start saving for that. Like, we'll be able to get that eventually. I think that's worthwhile. I think that's worthwhile. I know these trade for propitols, and I would like propitols, but we're not going to do that. All right, there's our 6P47, and, and we just crafted bleach as well. Uh, what do you trade for now? It's gear. So helmets. Oh, you are not nearly as good as you used to be. Okay, maps, not so good. Not so good. And what is this? It's maps and a hard drive. Okay, so I can sell these maps. They used to trade for armor. They don't anymore. That helmet's nice, and maybe we'll do that later. But right now, I'd much rather have the money. Much, much rather have the money. You're getting sold. We can start wearing the rivals instead of evasion. Actually, let's see which one sells for more. And then I'll wear whichever one sells for more. <laughs> it's how I'm going to play that. I'm just going to take up these things. Okay, so now we just need metal parts for our hole in the wall there. Definitely getting sold. Again, could trade for a propital with these, but right now, I don't think we can afford to do that. Selling that, selling that. Because they're straight up 50k rubles, by the way. Pretty nice. We are going to need that for booze. So let's get this stuff sold up here. Don't think this is going to be as lucrative as our other run, but that's fine. All right, I guess we're wearing the Rivals band for now. <laughs> Guess we're wearing the Rivals band. I do want to wear a band of some sort. I just... Yeah. Not going to bother with that. 
uh, mechanic. We're not selling this. We are selling that. That doesn't really count towards our total, but whatever. It's a thousand. So these get sold for decent dollar amounts, but um, yeah, so sixty k or thirty k less of that for our actual run here. Oh yeah, and I need to sell this SAS as well because I need rubles, and I, I have no good way to convert rubles here. So um, I might wear this Tarzan. Skull, Skull ring was actually a big one, and sell this sell or put this back to um being storage i think that'll be important this holds a lot then i gotta find room for this akmn any raid out that we survived exactly is profit exactly Exactly. Okay. Let me put this here. Let me put this on. Let me put this here. Uh, I think I might put this mechanism bag away as well. Yeah, just for now. Oh, this ne never got sold sell that. I want to see how this is works. I'm pretty sure they're worth a decent... Like, it's like 14k, right? 16k. Dang, yeah. Those are really good for one slaughters. Really good one slot items. What are we working towards right now? We're working towards stash 3. Um, We are working towards... This only has soft armor, right? Yeah. So Can't do much about that. Yeah, we're working towards stash 3. We're working towards... Um... Punisher part five. And we're working towards... That's really about it. The other goals we have kind of accomplished here. I need an eagle gunpowder uh, gun because I really need flipping... It's only like 3k there, but that's okay. Um, working towards eagle gunpowder, but I don't... Uh, just for ammo purposes. But I just haven't been able to find one. If I did boss dead now, it's not. It's at like 500 health, Freddy. Yeah, we don't need all of these Calic bees. Oh, what key did we get? Gas station safe key. That is an unusable key. That would be kind of cool if it was a key, a key thing, so only uh, players could get it. But yeah, usually the unusable keys are worth a lot less. By the way, if you didn't know. Okay, so what's my strategy here? What's my strategy here? Do What do we have in our hideout? Let me go load that up. All right, I am going to bring this back out. We're going to put the AKMN here. Or in one of these spots somehow. Uh, let's... We'll just take the stock off of it, I think. Because you, you can't use this stock for this task anyway. So we'll just do that. This is a full mag of PS, though. That's pretty cool. Get that stacked up. But yeah, that's going to be needed for a later gunsmith. Now, I do have access to... I think I'm selling this. I do have access to... Um, some SV-98 barters. I don't think I have any way to suppress them. So that's an issue. Let's get that sold. Let's let's go see what we have access to, I guess, is really the question. Let's get these sold. Let's get this sold. Let's just kind of clean up here a little bit. Let's craft a new one. Because what I could do is just... Hit this with repair. Maybe play a normal raid... On like customs with just an automatic and just go for it that way like like just bring this into customs um go for some dorms kills that are not the what we need it to be 
Then we can maybe get some Yushunkas out. You know? Um, that's not a terrible idea. Like, I don't think that's a bad idea at all. And we could even do it nighttime with the NVGs and just try to sneak around customs. I really actually kind of like that idea. And then we could loot safes there. Right, hit the Usex dash for that PT lock. You know, there's a bunch of good good spawns there as well. Honestly, I'd be more excited about a... Uh, I'd be more excited about a uh, flipping what's its face. Can't think of the name of it. Um, elite grip, <laughs> you know. All right, yeah. So let's let's do that. Let's do that. Let's see what we got going on here. Let's do that. I have some PBB somewhere, but I don't think I'm going to bother with that. We are going to do this, this, that. And then we're going to tag these as... Those are our good mags, air quotes. I know I have more of this junk. and raid but the founded raid does or sorry this stuff does craft the ap's which is nice honestly what we can do also is we can like get rid of that like we can we can get rid of certain things here like the one super performance we can get rid of this this, this is another way to clean up our stash a little bit here don't need these hp's That can stack. Yeah, this is actually what I should have been doing the whole time. And then next time we can also go in with like an AK with some um, PP rounds in it, and that's going to be totally fine as well. So, like, I think we have some options here. Oh, I meant to sell that. We got some good options here. Uh, this is has to come out for us. Uh, one of these goes in the gun. I guess I need to, if I'm going to use this rig, I need to use that guy. That's totally fine. We have a propotol now with two, which is nice. Okay. Now, we don't much care how we get the kills. Just care that we do. And then I do want to barter for a bag here, even if it's. Oh, I guess no, no, we have we have the scab bag. We'll just use a scab bag or a Burke. Yeah. Just use those. All right, I gotta go track down all of my dorms. Keys. Ah, see, I knew I was missing. I knew I was missing reserve keys, and I couldn't find them. They were in here. <laughs> Got it. Okay, there's reserve keys in here. Got it. We should actually take those out and replace them with uh, like things things that we need to bury versus that. <laughs> things that don't matter where they are in our stash, which is like ammo and gun parts. All right. There we go. That mystery solved there, chat. Mystery solved. Okay. We can put that in there. All right. Good. So I'm going to swap the keys. Uh, then we're going to hop on to... Oh, yeah. I need to get my 6B47 going. Sorry. Let me get that going. I think with that bleach, we actually have another one. Yes. So we have this plus one and a half or two and a half from our hideout, which is pretty cool. So we'll do that. We'll do this. This is all fine. Um, I'll, so I'm going to swap my keys now. We're going to hop onto nighttime customs. We're going to try to get some, you know, kind of sneaky kills here, but we're also going to try to loot up all the safes. We have every single safe key for dorms. So we're going to try to get those keys going. Uh, maybe somebody will up, be kind enough to un, uh, open up Mark Room for us. And we can get that going. We can maybe even like loot key, loot for keys, you know, grind out, grind out that mark room key, which would be really epic to to run and loot. So yeah, really great stuff. I'll see you on customs. All right, I took the MVGs off because it wasn't pure nighttime, and I didn't want to risk them when it's not pure nighttime. Yeah. So.
I think what I think they were friends. I think one was AFK. And one was in their inventory. I will not complain though. In the actual slightest. build. Okay, well, there's Yushunkas for setup. Wish I could take all these armors and stuff. I, I genuinely think one person was like in their inventory and the other person was AFK. So, if that's the case, I'm so sorry. Just know that your kills are very valuable to me. And Punisher 5 kills are more important to me than setup kills at the moment. Five Punisher 5 kills left now. I guess I really don't have room for loot, huh? I'm sorry, how? Plates? So this is where the plates become good, right? God damn. Like, all I need to do is flip up a little. So I'm trying to get practice shooting here, not here. Like, I not only hit them, but like... Like, look at this. Damage absorbed by armor. Look at this. Look at this number. So, this is how plates go. They're either indestructible... Or... You you get murdered, right? I use seventy eight ammo, and I just I just happen to be hitting the top of their plate, you know, man. But I'm trying to get to, like here is where you want to aim. So I was just a little bit too low, you know, a little bit too low. Bomber, that would have been three kills and a dorm skill there. But I'll take the two. I'll take the two. I'll take the two kills, you know. Right, if you hit the plate, it deals zero. If you hit if you if you miss the plate, it's one to two tap, you know? So they'll be happy though. They got a dorm skill and they, well if they're on the dorm skills, but they got a setup kill. Everybody's working on setup right now. Which actually makes me think that customs is the way to go for this. Because um Let's go to hide out here. The customs is the way to go for this because there's going to be a bunch of people running around with shotguns. And if I can keep range from them, they're not going to be able to get me. And pack is like okay against shotguns. Not great, but like I have more of a chance of stopping a shotgun round than I do PP rounds. So yeah, I think that's where we're, what we're going to be doing with this. 
Bummer, though. Real bummer. I came out there pretty confidently, too. But, ah, eh, well. So what are you gonna do? Let's, uh, let's, let's get this guy going. Modding. No. No. I kind of want something with a little bit more range. But I don't want to use this thing up. I think we'll be okay with this, though. We just finished that one, so let's use that guy. Let's also get uh, a big 60 rounder. Let's get a big 60 rounder. Uh, let's use that thing as well. Or maybe not that thing. Let's use let's use one of these things. And let's use that thing. Get this thing feeling real smooth for range. Uh, I think I've got a barter for the other thing that I want. You have a laser on you. You do not have a laser on you. I see. You're like tough to get a laser onto. Interesting. So there's not really a good way to get a laser onto this. Could also go long range scope, uh, side scope, but nah. All right. Well, no laser for us then. Uh, what was I gonna do? So I need a, I need this thing now. I got my adrenaline going though. And then I need this guy here, because I think we got out with one of these. Yeah, this is like a, this is a great, just middle of the line. Doesn't matter. Can throw it away in the middle of a raid, but don't necessarily have to. Uh, kind of thing. Okay, those all go there. I do want ears. Who did that? Oxy, thank you so much for the Prime. For freaking eight months. That's so supportive. I really appreciate that. Something for 17 today. That's a big deal as well. Thank you, guys. Oh, I lost both my... Um, Sure, maybe I should have tried to grenade that guy, honestly. Probably what I should, should have tried to do. Oh, and then I want to do this barter as well. I don't know if we need thermometers anywhere, but we'll do we'll do one. And then what we'll do is, because I have a... Oh, I guess we do. Oh, we have BP. We have, we have this. So what we can do is we can do this, that, for our starter mag, and then all the 30s. We'll put um, PP in. And then we'll swap this for some BP so we can top load that. Perfect. All right, now we just need meds. Can use this guy now. Okay, I think we're good to go. I think we're good to go. Or as good as we're going to be. Oh, uh, it could be proper. It's uh, not could be. It's going to be proper nighttime now. So I am going to swap this on. Um, although I, I don't have a flashlight. Otherwise, I, would, I wouldn't I would do that. And we're going to, like I said, same strat. Same strat. Just with nighttime. I'll see it, right? All right, here we go. All right, we're spawned for what I'm trying to do now, I guess. But can give it a shot here. Cursed red spawn, yeah. We can fight in here, though. No Rashala. Oh, yeah, loosely looking for Rashala as well. But. <laughs> Killing me sitting here. Person out here trying to say really nice, heartfelt things. You're like, what about the cats? <laughs> Which I know is the joke. Look, the cats are very cute. They deserve the love every once in a while. Don't let them fool you. They don't deserve the love every single second of every single day, okay? Hey, what's up, Slightly Squeamish? Yeah. How you been? It's great to see you. 
shot at me. Okay. We'll push towards that. I like some light trolling from time to time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, focus that fine. Not, stop reading chat. Sorry, dude, but I need the kills real bad. Do you have a friend? That is always the question. Okay, props to them. I think he got a... Oh my gosh. This person's amazing. Well done. I'm almost positive this person just got a crowbar kill on this scav. And I'm super impressed. I'm being honest with you. Doing great. Uh, hope all is well. My son's two years old already? Holy crack. I don't know why it's is it crack and not crap, but I meant holy crap. Wow. That's wild. Yeah, no, for sure. Congratulations. I hope everything's been smooth and, and, and good and you're just enjoying life. Sounds wonderful. Really awesome. Yeah, this guy totally got a crowbar kill. By the way. It's a little bright for my tastes. What you got for me? Ooh, that's good. I forgot to bring money, so I guess we're grabbing these. Wow, that's actually really solid. Okay. I think I'm going to start to need these. Yeah, everything's been good with us. We're just chilling. I've been playing a bit more Tarkov lately. Well, this wipe has been really, really good. But we still play, still been playing some Minecraft. Got addicted to Vault Hunters. It's a really fun Minecraft mod pack that I've been really, really loving. Um, kind of winding down on it a little bit, but, you know, might have some future plans coming up. Um, but I've been so flipping addicted to this this hardcore run of Tarkov. It's, this wipe has just been so much fun. So, so much fun. It's hard to, uh, hard to put down, you know? Okay, this raid got real quiet. Yeah, kitted rifles feel like laser beams and wonderful. Pretty sure that storms. Which is, I guess, where we're heading. Um, and agreed. Unkitted rifles feel like passable, usable, especially if you get the drop on somebody, if you know what you're doing. Tap firing feels amazing. I don't know. There's just a lot. A lot of positives. That help hardcore. This is all good for hardcore, you know?
And we've had the usual Tarkov's ups and downs. Like, don't get me wrong. We've definitely had some Tarkov's ups and ups and downs here. But that's that's the nature of the game. That's just how it goes. That's a little dark to see through. So. Side here. Pack fifteen. Yeah, I can't put a laser. For some, I don't have the mount for the laser on this gun, unfortunately. I could have put a laser on my helmet or a flash under my helmet. I like the, I like the idea of blinding people with MVGs. It's definitely happened before. All right, somebody took Gorms out already, which. Gives us a decent chance for Marked Room being open. And getting this marker down. Also, maybe some bodies with some Yushunkas on them. Which, probably not. People are making room for them because they're like 80k on the market, but you never know. Could also be some stragglers. There you go. back where you can forget you have a mouse there's a lot of links to tab through to get to the uh, chat window including all of chat dang Hard part is you can't. This isn't. This isn't. Absolutely quiet. Just saw a light here. Yeah. That's a little sus. Hello? What? I don't know about that. I don't know about that. That was weird.
That was really weird. Maybe I missed... Did I miss something there, chat? Like, there was a flashlight there. Maybe there's a player above and I was missing them. Like, was there a player on the second floor that I wasn't looking at? I would love to see a clip of that. Huh. Don't know. Oh, well. We got one kill, I guess. That was really weird. Maybe it was behind me? Like, that that also could have been from behind me as well, you know? Like, maybe that was the Mosin guy from behind. And we just didn't hear them on the back there. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. You look at the clip now? Nice. All right. Um, let's sell here. What time do we have there? All right. That's, that's fine. Let's sell this junk here, though. Clean out stash. This is another good thing is we did we did get to clean out our stash there a little bit, which is nice. Definitely nice. Let's get all these things sold though. And then we have one more pack of 6B47. We have one more pack of 6B47. Um I, I think I'm gonna use one of these instead of that. I, I I really think that person may have been behind us. That's really kind of my only explanation there. Um, I guess the question now is, what are we using here? Uh, let's go look in our hideout. Okay, uh, after looking at the clip, so it wasn't behind us. You can just, you can just see it under the sight of my clip, the, the, the top bar of my hollow. I'm glad I didn't report. The top bar of my hollow, um, you can see legs pop out, go back in, pop back out. So they, they popped out, saw me, popped back in to get cover, popped back out, saw that I was ADSing, and just owned me. So it was a team of two in there, or there was a scab with a flashlight down below, or whatever, what you know, what have you. So, GG. And that's on me for not looking at the second store, because I got distracted by the flashlight down below, you know? Simple as that. Simple as that. All right, I think we're going to use this, because this is what we have the most best bullets for. So, put this away for now. So, GG. GG. And that, you know, that's why having having your stuff, being able to, like, review it can help a lot. For sure. Alright, let's go modding here. What can we do with you? I would prefer to be suppressed. Oh, yeah, we can definitely be suppressed here. Let's be suppressed. Yeah, I prefer to be suppressed. Don't need to be suppressed. Let's go ahead and do this. Oh, and I do have... Yeah flashlight capabilities here which is fantastic um i don't think we need to upgrade the stock here or that and then i think we're gonna load those two in and then i need to get my pack armor trait so we have a, we have one more trade here i mean this is working we've got We've got a few, and this will, you know, we'll maybe we'll get it done in this this kind of push here, but maybe we'll also have to build up our stock again, and that's okay. That's okay. We're getting, we at least plus three here, right? So far, hopefully we're gonna plus more than just three. Uh, no more compacts, which is unfortunate, but that's what we got. All right, we'll go a little bit more budget here. It's also good. We are clearing up our stash a little bit more, which is actually nice <laughs> okay what did you guys have you had pp pp dead pine and why did the tiger PP. use a knife and fork PP. to eat so the monkey we'll do that. because there's no wrong way to eat uh, a i can't top that up anymore but that's okay and then we'll do this and then we'll do that and then we'll do you and you and I think we're good. I think we're good. We're as good as we're going to be, you know. Um, we have a nice flashlight here, so we can try, try to blind some folks in um, dorms. This will bring this as well. So, okay. Good stuff. That's going to do it for this episode, though. YouTube, Twitch chat, don't go anywhere. That's not the end of the stream. It's just the end of this YouTube episode. Thanks all for tuning in. Watching this all the way through. We are plus three on our um, Punisher Part 6 um we actually also have one dorm skill maybe no we don't have one dorm skill that's okay though not worried about that oh i didn't hand in nostalgia chat you had one job you had one job remind me to hand in nostalgia that's the reason we got out of that raid <laughs> god dang it 
I blame, I 100% blame chat on that one. That is not my fault. I blame chat. I blame chat by a lot. Um, okay, it's all good though. It's all good though. Uh, where are we at here? Punisher part five. Yeah, so we need four more. Totally reasonable to get, not in one raid, but yeah. Totally reasonable to get um, relatively soon. And then we're on to the SPDS kills, which are gonna be rough, which are gonna be rough. Um, customs is popping, so I think customs would be a good way to get it done. Uh, but I don't know, we'll see. We'll see on that. But YouTube, thanks so much for tuning in. I will see you on the loading screen in the next episode tomorrow. Make sure you sub to the channel if you haven't already. I'd love to have you back. And uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. We'll catch you in the next one.